happy Saturday. Welcome to my channel. If you don't know who I am, my name is Desby, and you have stumbled across my YouTube channel. If you're new here, hello, and if you're not new here, welcome back. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and click that little button so you never miss a video from me. month has gone by we are in March I don't know how I feel about it cuz holy shizoki it's March and that means my birthday is coming up which is so exciting it's April 6th for those of you wondering but I'm so excited because that means that I get to do my second not my fourth my second ever favorites video and I have a few great things that I've been using all month for you guys to try hopefully as well I know how hard it can be to order things online, try things that you haven't tried before, as well as kind of not have any reviews on them. So I'm here to hopefully ease the pain for a few things that you might be looking for this month. So without further ado, let's get her done. Starting in order of importance here, my first favorite of the month are my brand new shoes. These are the Adidas Quest Star. They are beautiful, like prettier than me. First off, these are very like orthopedic. Yeah, literally, they're ortho like floats. They're literally like a cloud. I think it might even say that. <laughs> it feels like a cloud on your foot. These are not the NMDs, very obviously. Like I said, these are the Quest Star in white. I have really tried my best to keep them clean, but what I end up doing is kind of not wearing them into the gym unless it's 100% nice outside. And then when I get there, I change. Yeah. I'm in that person. But I really love these shoes because they are super light on the foot. They look so aesthetic in videos and in pictures and they just really pop as well as they match anything. I love white. These were, I got these in Arizona at an outlet. Yeah, like an outlet. They were, I think I paid literally $50 for them. I'm a bargain shopper. Hello, it's Des. I like to save money. So if you're looking for a new pair of shoes, I'm sure you could pick these up online. Very cheap. Again, Adidas Quest Star. Oh yeah, see? Quest Star Drive literally says cloud foam. They ain't lying, folks. These are good. 12 out of 10. My next product is a little bit more electronic here, so stick with me. This is my portable charger. This is a portable charger by Sonics. It's very cute, not only that, but it also has this nice little area, oops, where you can literally pop out the charger itself and it sits nicely behind your phone. So you're not like bulky power bank next to you. It sits nice in your palm with your phone on top of it and it can be plugged in. I really like this thing. It was 40 bucks, worth every penny. I've used it quite a few times. There's a little charging button on the back that you can see what the charge is at. Again, very cute. Um, it is a little bit of a quote-unquote splurge, but if you're someone that's always on your device, like me, this is a really great place to start in terms of power banks. Sonics always creates very great products, as well as very cute. <laughs> it's so cute, right? I love flowers. Um, if you guys don't know that about me, by now you probably should. Again, 40 bucks, Sonics. I got it at at and I'm sure you could sweep this up online if you kind of, if you Googled it or even went on at and you know what I mean? My next favorite is very helpful and very useful. This is my new Vure bag. How cute is this? This is a very nice large duffel, has a nice attachable, whatever this is called, um, I don't even know. This has a large attachable thing. Um, if I could figure out what to get it called, can make it bigger or smaller. The thing I really like about this is that the, <laughs> I'm literally blanking. The thing, the band, the holder, the strap. The strap attaches on both sides. So it, it sits really nicely over you as a crossbody bag instead of it being on like the same side, if that makes sense. Has a tons of, ton of different compartments inside, very huge, like I could literally put my head in it and probably a body. And it also is very cute. Um, I love this color, I love the style, and I plan on taking this to Cabo, so I'm super excited. 
My next favorite is clothing, and I think this is so just freaking dang cute. It's my dog on a shirt. Look at this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's Jaxi. I got this shirt made from Pop Your Pup. This is a muscle tee crop. So it is a crop style. It also comes in very close, has a racer back, and it really shows off the shoulders. I love that about it. But this is literally my dog on a shirt. They're such a great company. I sent them a lot of pictures that I liked of Jax, and they're like, okay, we picked this one. Like, let us know how it looks. I got to pick the background color. Um, there's tons of different options. You can do different colors, like behind the picture. But they literally, it's called at pop your pup. So they literally like cartoon pop it and put it on a shirt, which uh, if y'all are animal lovers like me and you love your puppy or your cat or your thing, pop your pup. I, it is pop your pup, but I wonder if they do cats. I'm not sure, sorry I said that. Someone ask. <laughs> My next favorite thing is something I've been using for a while, but I feel like I've gotten a lot of questions lately on how to drink more water. I understand that this is such a struggle because water sometimes is just, not good. It is just so plain. I can't even explain it. What I've been doing is uh, using a big water bottle that I cannot see into. I think that is what makes me the most intimidated is when I'm looking at a gallon, I see all this liquid and I'm like, oh frick, I have to get this all down. What? So by having a big water bottle and not being able to see into it, I tend to drink it easier as well as like, usually I'm just chugging. I go for like, I'm like, okay, 10 chugs. <laughs> You guys know how it is. So without further ado, my next favorite product is my Tikia water bottle. This is a 40 ounce water bottle. I've literally dropped this so many times everywhere. It's just not dying guys and I love it. I have this in purple and in teal. It is like a no slip and a no drip lid. It's called the best lid ever. That's what they market it as and it really is. It comes off just like this. It has a nice little area um, to make sure that water does not come out. You seal it back up. It's like literally a canteen. It's amazing. It has a little holder. Don't need to use that that often, but still, I really love this water bottle. Like I said, it's 40 ounces, so just drinking four of these gets me to a gallon a day, and I tend to honestly drink anywhere from five to six just because I can't see it. So I'm just chugging all the time. Chugging. Now I'm thirsty. And it keeps your water cold. That's good. My next few items are pure beauty. I've been getting a lot of questions the past month about my skin. I have a hair on me. About my skin. My skin has literally cleared up so much, guys. And I've also <laughs> learned how to do my eyebrows. But my skin is literally glowy because I've been taking care of it so much. About a month ago, I... <laughs> about a week ago... <laughs> About a month ago, I got my birth control taken out because I had an IUD, which is an intrauterine device. I ended up going off of birth control because I was getting terrible acne along my lat region and behind my shoulders, all the way down to my lower back, um, kind of on my neck. It, it was just really making me super self-conscious. You guys know how acne is. It, it can be so embarrassing, especially when it's like all over your body. And so I got off birth control. It immediately started clearing up, but I still had to take care of this. So what I've been using is Tula Skin Care. It was in my January favorites video. I am going to be getting a code for them soon. I'm super excited because I want to share this with people. I've heard so many different people using skincare products from like proactive to Neutrogena and they see all these results and I've never been able to attain results. But ever since I started using Tula, my skin has literally resurfaced. I have beautiful glowy skin in the morning and at night. I've been using their whole skin set from morning time, right when I wake up, before I go downstairs, all the way to at night before I go to bed. I've done this religiously two times a day for the past month and like two weeks now and I have seen so much of a difference. It is crazy. My makeup goes on better. I wake up just like brighter. My skin looks better. I don't have as much redness around my eyes and like my my cheekbone area. It's it's awesome. So without further ado, long story short, one of my new favorite products is their brand new kefir mask. This is so beautiful to even put on guys. I swear, these things are prettier than me. You take about two to three pumps of this, which it comes out pretty thick. It's an iridescent purple 
like white looking substance. It feels kind of like a very nice lotion. And after you're done washing your face and you have a clean slate, so to speak, you put this on very lightly all across your face, just like you would a normal mask. It just doesn't like stick. And what it does is it recovers um, your skin with the probiotics in it. So you kind of let it sit for 10 minutes and then you use a damp towel and just kind of, you know, dab it off. Then from there, you kind of wipe in the extra excess, like, lotion-y stuff, so to speak. I guess it would be called, it'd just be like lotion, I don't know. But uh, you rub the rest in, whew, you literally feel so good in your skin. Like, it just feels so soft, it feels so moisturized, not oily, oh, it's just, I freaking love it. So, two to three pumps, like I said, of this, it is, so great. Again, Tula Skin Care, Kiefer Ultimate Recovery Mask. All of their products are made with probiotics and I really think that's what's made a difference in my skin. My last three products are also beauty. Sorry guys, but it has been the month of self-care. So my next product is this Amika Dry Shampoo. I got this when I was in New York from Tula and I have been obsessed with it. It smells like a freaking goddess jungle. Like if Beyonce was in the rainforest, this is what this can is. I absolutely have been negligent of the dry shampoo Bon Voyage, but now I'm on that dry shampoo train and I love this. It, I, I put it into my roots in the morning, um, usually post leg day because I hate showering and washing my hair after leg day. I just am so freaking tired. So I massage it into my roots, I comb it out and my hair has so much volume. It smells great and it looks very rejuvenated. Re <laughs> It looks very rejuvenated and it looks pretty instead of it being like gross. And right now my roots are so bad. I'm getting them done Wednesday, but this is what we're working with and it's masked a lot of pain. <laughs> my next beauty product that I've loved is my brand new primer, refresher, and setting spray. This is the Too Faced Hangover Spray. This stuff is three in one, like I said, it's a setting spray, a refreshing spray, and a priming spray. A weightless three in one coconut water infused mist that primes, sets, and refreshes makeup while keeping the skin hydrated. It does smell just like coconut, and honestly, I love that, but it just, it brings this nice spritz onto you. It doesn't feel like a freaking waterfall going on your face for a spray. Um, it's just nice and easy. Here, I'll do it for you guys. Like, I just feel like new. I mean, do I look new? Cause that's how it makes me feel. But I love this stuff. I got this at Sephora. You can also probably get it at Ulta, probably Amazon. <laughs> I love Amazon. But again, Hangover by Too Faced, three in one spray, the goat. My last product, as well as my last monthly favorite is, I don't know if this is a new thing, I'm not sure, is my NYX Microcellular Water. This, oh, it's my cellular. <laughs> Not a beauty guru. <laughs> okay, my micellular water. This stuff is so gentle in taking off your makeup. I've tried, I swear to God, every type of pad, stuff, oil to get my makeup off. This literally comes off like a baby's bottom. I use a cotton um, circle, which if you guys know, I'm terrified of cotton balls, so I stick with just the little circles and I take off all my makeup and then that's when I perform my skin routine. So this helps me get a lot of the excess oil, dirt, makeup off before my skin routine. So I think this has also contributed to my total skincare just because I'm able to get every little bit off my face before I go to bed at night. This was literally at Walmart or Target for like maybe four bucks. I've had it for the whole month of maybe even half of January into this month and this is how much I've used that tells you anything, that is a good investment. It's like one cent per wash. I love it. That is all I have for you guys today for my February favorites. A little bit different for you guys, but I hope that you loved it. If you haven't already, make sure, like I said, give this video a thumbs up or else I'm coming for you. Just kidding. I can't wait to see you guys Wednesday. We are starting a new series, Get Pumped, prep series, Q and A's, all that fun stuff. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. I love you. See you then.